Okay, so I've decided to do a blue tint, oh no, sorry, purple tinge over the eyelids <coughs> uh, before I start the skin flesh tones. The amount I'm going to use is very, very minute. Now, this is just a um, a, a, a part of it, the uh, tea and coffee disposable stir things that take the place of a teaspoon. And I'm not even squeezing the uh, tube. I'm only taking what's... Oh, I might have to squeeze because there's hardly anything there. What's on the top. Yeah, if I squeeze that too much, I don't know whether you can see. Um, I'm not going to take all of it. So nothing's coming out. <clears throat> so I'm doing it very carefully because I don't want... Whoa! That's why I was doing it very carefully. Okay, so just enough to have stained the tip of it, okay? So I'm just going to wipe this excess paint off. And um, didn't do a very good job there, did I? I've got it all smudged here. All right, we'll just get rid of this for now. And I'll, yes, the squeaky chair is still with me. Oh, I haven't had time. In fact, I haven't even worked on these babies for the past few days because I just um, had too much other things happening all at once. And um, I just didn't have to, oh, <coughs> excuse me, didn't have the time. Now, why has that gone pink? I must have had some pink paint in my, in my syringe. It really doesn't matter because it's not affected the purple in any way. And you can see, I hope, because this camera and I never get along, it's really a translucent purple. So if I think that I'm getting too much paint in there, I'll just stop. I've still got some paint left on the end here. So um, I'm going to get one of these dis disposable here, little cosmetic wands as they call them or whatever and I'm just going to give it another mix with this make sure there's no little lumps or anything left in the paint and very very translucent may even need two coats so only on the closed eye babies we're just going to give them a light it is so light actually you can't you can't even see it. So perhaps I'll mix in a little bit more paint. What was left on the stick? Oops, got the head in the way and you can't see. So just going to take that, mix it in with the distilled water. That's all I've added in this too, it's distilled water, I didn't add any other. It's not a big amount to do. Now this is quite light as well. You know what, I forgot a cosmetic sponge. I'm just going to dab that. It's a bit stuck in the um, slit, eye slit. I'll just pick that up with this applicator, which is again, it's in cosmetic I don't even know what they're called but there's little cosmetic application things um, and I'll show you the baby in a minute but I, th I think maybe two or three coats are warranted because this is so light but see I don't want it too dark so that the baby looks like it's wearing um, there's the, uh, the eye that's done and the eye that's not uh, look, it looks like it's wearing um, Oops. Uh, eyeshadow. That's not our aim. So this is about the fourth coat. And then we'll um, decide whether it needs any more. And I'm going to go over the bridge of the nose with this too. That's about four coats there. Four or five actually. So I'm going to do the same on the other side. Just start from the corner and work out. Oops. 
towards this end. Right down like that. Don't get it on other parts of the face. And remember, it is air dry paints, so they do dry quite quickly. You make a mistake, you need to be on top of it straight away. Just going to turn her this way so I can. Oops. Again. You can compare it to the other eye, which seems to be still quite dark. So just apply a little bit more. Take the excess off. Off the nose, it's not to belong there. I have a bang on the nose on this side, and I think this might just do it. It's a very, very subtle layer. The other side's dried already, so it is rather warm today. So I don't expect that these paints are going to. Um, take too long to dry at all. Just there. I don't know why there's a spot there that refuses to be coloured. Don't know why. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Oops. Oh, so there she is. Done. With her eyelids. I'm going to do Kofu because he's another sleeper. The other two are not. He's got squinty eyes as well. And here we go. We're just adding a little bit of an amount. Now each baby's going to differ. They're not all going to take the same amount. That's the first layer I'm doing on both sides this time. No particular reason. I just feel like it. Okay. 